Like playing tricks? Can't live without pranks? We know how to amaze you! Would you like some gummy candies? Don't say yes until you taste it! Carefully tear the gummy pack. Put in some fine salt. Shake well. Hot glue the pack. Treat your friend with the gummy bear. She doesn't seem to like the taste. The baby bear must have swum in the salt sea. Don't you believe it? Try it yourself. The salted gummies are trash compared to the mustard-filled chocolate I can propose. Make a hole in the chocolate bottom. Fill it with mustard. Remove the excess with a napkin. Spread soft chocolate and tuck it to cover the hole. Put on the wrapper. Give the stuffed chocolate to your friend and take the ordinary one for yourself. Oh, poor girl! Mustard and chocolate is a weird combination. Make a special surprise for your friend's breakfast. Supply her with bottomless provisions for flakes. Remove flakes from the package. Cut off the bottom. Put the flakes into the bottomless box. Close it and carefully put it in its usual place. Your friend's going to have breakfast. She takes the flakes and gets them on the floor. What a pity! I'll have to clean up instead of having breakfast. I know for sure how to make her worry. A spider is what she's scared of. Tie a plastic spider to a string like a web. Toss it over a branch. Now you can move it up and down. Loosen the thread to let the spider go down before your friend's face. Her reaction is always the same. Her arachnophobia makes her jump up and run away. <laughs> so should I. Do you want to get a snack? Offer your friend a special sandwich. You'll have to make it in advance. Wrap a plain good sandwich in plastic wrap. Draw black spots on. Ugh! They look like dirt or mold. Make a few wraps more to make the spots look as if they are on the bread, not on the wrap. Treat your friend. She takes it eagerly at first, but gives it back as soon as she sees the disgusting spots on it. Okay, I'll eat it if you don't want to. Unwrap the sandwich a bit and start eating. Your friend is shocked. How can I eat this stuff? I reveal the secret and we laugh together. I got ready for a picnic as well. I have an unusual salt shaker. Tear off a piece of paper napkin of the top size. Place it to cover the holes and put on the top. It works! She tries to salt her sandwich, but fails. She blows in the holes in vain. Finally, she takes off the top. Meanwhile, I couldn't miss the opportunity to eat the sandwich I refused so carelessly. Mmm, it's actually tasty. She likes taking pictures. Let her worry about her smartphone camera. Shade a piece of thin clear tape with a blue marker. Tape the camera. Remove the excess color, leaving it on the camera only. Dark blue won't be visible on the dark camera. Check how it works. Perfect! Everything is so blue! Ask your friend to take a picture of you on her phone. She turns on the camera, but there's something wrong with it. It seems there's some blue light filter on. Finally, she guesses who is to blame. A magic apple for Snow White? No, it's an apple to prank your friend. Boil shortcut orzo pasta shaped like large grains of rice. Place it on a plate. Let it dry. Use a black food marker to turn the pasta into larvae. Draw the distinguished spots on the ends. Prepare an apple. Core it. Put in the larvae. 
Tuck toothpicks inside to stick the top. Turn the apple stem down. Let's get a light snack. I won't let my friend bite the apple as she can get pricked with the toothpick. I cut it in half. It looks as if there's a larvae home inside. I bite the apple, but my friend faints. She's so sensitive. Hey, Snow White, wake up. These M&M candies have a weird smell. Is it a new onion filling variation? Cut an onion in half. Take some M&Ms and spread the onion juice all over. Put the candies back into the pack. Open the M&M's package and treat your friend. She doesn't look happy to taste the new onion filling. I pretend to eat the candies but put them into my pocket instead. Oh, she seems to guess about my trick. I should run away. Do you like getting coffee to go? Be careful with the cup. Cut out the bottom of a paper cup. Cover the top with a piece of plastic wrap and press it to sag. Pour in a little water. Put on the top. Cut off the excess. My friend opens her coffee. Oops! Waterfall! Oh yes, our pranks seem to be a bottomless source of fun. I've got amazing wax crayons. Remove the labels from the wax crayons. Cut off the top and the bottom. Join them with a wire. Heat the wire end above the flame and tuck it into the wax cutout. Place the crayon of the same color in hot water. Remove the label without tearing or cutting. When the paper is dry, wrap it around the wax tipped wire. Glue the edge. Give the special wax crayon to your friend. What's happened? It's broken in our hands. And another again! What's wrong with these crayons? They're more fragile than glass. My friend can't tame her flyaway hair. A claw clip could help her. And I've got one. Break the opposite claws with pliers. My friend tries in vain to fasten her hair with the clip. Hey Rapunzel, don't tame your beautiful hair. Has she forgotten her notebook again? I can give her my special one. Let's work on the notebook before pranking. Attach the pages with a glue stick. My friend tries to open the notebook, but she can't. The sticky margins don't let her make notes. Okay, I've got pencils that don't draw. Take a few pencils from the pack. Snip off the tips. Put them back into the pack. My friend takes a pencil. Oh, I think someone's not off the tip. She'll hardly be able to draw with these pencils. She'll certainly need a sharpener. I've worked on it. Let's see what we've got. Open a sharpener. Loosen the screw. Remove the blade. My friend is bewildered as she can't sharpen a pencil. At the same time, her reaction is too sharp. Okay, it's just a trick. I don't want to quarrel. I give her a regular sharpener to use. Take a switch and double-sided mounting tape. Two pieces will be enough. Attach them to the back. Repeat for an outlet. Done! Your friend's going to charge her phone. She'll need an outlet. Tape it to the wall next to the door. It looks as if it's been there for years. She must think it's real. Where can I charge my phone, I wonder? Aha! Here's an outlet. What's wrong? The plug's okay, but it doesn't charge. Oops! It seems I've broken the outlet. No, I haven't. That's it. What about the switch? The same thing. Cool! Look, I can charge my phone with my own energy. And so can you. It won't take much time and effort for preparing this prank. Enjoy it together. We've got a few more pranks. Does your friend like to put a lemon slice in her tea or cola? Treat her with a special lemon. Press it with your hands to make it produce more juice. Suck it into a syringe as much as possible. 
suck blue food coloring. Squeeze it to color the lemon flesh. The more coloring you put in, the more saturated the shade of the fresh lemon will be. Do you want some lemon? Here you are! The sweetest moment is to see your friends look and pretend you've got nothing to do with it. Now, watch carefully. She may pay you back using your own prank. I've prepared a special piece of fruit for you. Take a banana and food coloring. Suck burgundy liquid. Eject it to fill the fruit. When you finished, treat your friend with the fruit. She likes them so much. Watch her reaction. Yeah, the color's disgusting. She's never seen such a banana before. Be sure to subscribe. Hit the like button if you liked the video. Remember to click the bell to know when a new video comes out.